Well, hey y'all, welcome back. Start to uh, week three of my life here in Glacier National Park. I'm up at Watering Glacier International Peace Park. Customs is right over here. Uh, this port of entry is closed, um, so you can't get across here, but uh, I'm gonna hike from Chief Mountain Trailhead here uh, on down to Many Glacier Hotel where I live. It is going to take me three days of hiking, so I got two nights on a backcountry permit. Two of my favorite uh, campgrounds in the park. Can't wait to show y'all. Here we go. Well, I have a lot of friends out on the Pacific Northwest Trail, and I have some friends out on the Continental Divide Trail this year. And I am lucky enough, over the next couple days, I'm going to be hiking on both. So, that's pretty cool. Well, just getting to camp number one, Cosley Lake, uh, one of my favorite campgrounds in the whole park. I'm gonna get down here and drop my food off and then uh, set my tent up. Looks like we got a full camp tonight. And this right here is why this is my favorite camping spot in the park. Well, it's about eight o'clock, but it's 420 somewhere. Well, I think I'm going to take in this view for just a few more minutes and go uh, curl up in my tent. I got an early day today or tomorrow. I got like 19 and a half miles, almost 6,000 feet of climb. Right there where you're starting to see the waterfalls come down. That's where I'm climbing up tomorrow, right in the middle of the screen there. Should be pretty fun. Good morning, y'all. It is July 29th. And I'm just sitting here having coffee in the kitchen area here. And, uh, yeah. Gonna get up Indian, Stony Indian Pass today. And, uh, hopefully get to my campsite, 50 Mountain, uh, before the storms roll in. See you later, Cosley Lake. Till next time. Well, these right here are the start of those waterfalls that I kind of zoomed in on last night. They look like a small trickle from where I was about 10 miles back, but they're raging right now. Pretty cool to be up here this, this early in the year.
Well, up and over Stony Indian Pass. And now I'm coming down the other side. That's Stony Indian Lake down there. And gorgeous views in the valley. Well, as you can see, my tent is set up pretty funny, but not much I could do. Um, I'm almost done with uh, like 5,800 feet of climb today. Um, and I, I was just spent, so um, the flies are horrible in this area. So I had to just pop this tent up real quick. I'm, uh, I'm glad I chose to bring my freestanding tent instead of my trekking pole tent. I don't know why I did, it just uh, felt right. And uh, all right, I got about a mile and a half to camp. So hopefully the storm just rolls over quick. like the trail is trying to cheer me up after a really hard day all these uh cool reddish pinkish flowers they're called indian paint brushes and they are one of my favorite flowers and this meadow is full of them so cool oh and then that over there too Well, I got the camp set up and ate half my dinner. Couldn't stand all the bugs. There's a sweet mix of, uh, I don't know, mosquitoes, black flies, deer flies, horse flies, um, big old giant flies I've never seen before. And they are all out in full force. So if you're not moving, it is just brutal. Um, so I scarfed down half my dinner and now I am chilling out of the rain in my tent. Well, it was a pretty good day today. Um, I could complain and probably will, I'm sure. Um, the bugs and the 5,800 feet of climb. Um, it could possibly be the hardest day I've had on trail. But I'm in the backcountry in Glacier. Um, amazing views. And today... I got to meet up with a good friend, Skunk Bear, from the CDT. I had no idea her and her partner were out hiking the PNT, the Pacific Northwest Trail. And uh, yeah, so I got to meet up with them, talk for a little bit as much as we could with the bugs flying around. Um, hopefully they'll stop in and see me at Glacier um, or at work. And uh, if they don't, I mean, I might never see you guys again. So love you. And, uh, yeah, happy trails. Be safe. And I guess on that note, I'll kind of go over trail names. Um, so when you hike trails, long distance trails, especially, um, you get a nickname. Usually, um, hikers usually give it to you. Um, other hikers, anybody really, I guess. Um, I, my trail name's unit. Um, it used to be Unity, and I shortened it to Unit. Um, people on the Ice Age Trail also know me as Airborne. Um, there's usually a story between, behind each uh, nickname, and there are for both of mine. And then, uh, so Skunk Bear. <laughs> uh, just so you're not thrown off, um, that's her trail name. And uh, you know what? I really don't know her by anything else. And uh, that's how it usually goes out here um, on trail, is... Uh, we know each other by trail name, and unless you ask, we really usually don't tell you our real name. Um, I guess kind of weird, but, hmm. but anyways, didn't want to leave you hanging, thinking I met some kind of half skunk, half bear, or something. But anyways, good night. <laughs>
pretty bouncy. Whoa! Holy fuck! 